The sixth season of the animated television series, Aqua Teen Hunger Force originally aired in the United States on Cartoon Network's late-night programming block, Adult Swim. Season 6 started on March 29, 2009 with Jean E. and ended with Last Last One Forever and Ever on May 31, 2009, with a total of 10 episodes. Aqua Teen Hunger Force is about the surreal adventures and antics of three anthropomorphic fast food items, Master Shake, Frylock, and Meatwad, who live together as roommates and frequently interact with their human next-door neighbor, Carl Brutananadilevsky in a suburban neighborhood in South New Jersey. In May 2015, this season became available on Hulu+. Plus. The season 6 finale, Last Last One Forever and Ever, was made as a special live action episode the episode features david long jr who had won a contest though burger king in order to perform the role of a live action carl episodes in season six were written and directed by dave willis and matt maialaro almost every episode in this season features a special guest appearance which continues a practice used in past seasons Jonah Krakow of IGN has given episodes from this season a range of both positive and negative reviews. Krakow criticized, Last Last One Forever and Ever, and went on to call it, Over Hyped. Willis and Mayalaro initially believed that, Last Last One Forever and Ever, would be the final episode of the series, which would make season six the final season. However, the series was ultimately renewed for a seventh season. This season has been made available on DVD, and other forms of home media, including on-demand streaming. Topic. Production Every episode in this season was written and directed by series creators Dave Willis and Matt Maialaro, who have both written and directed every episode of the series. All episodes originally aired in the United States on Cartoon Network's late-night programming block, Adult Swim. This season was one of the original seasons branded under the Aqua Teen Hunger Force title before Willis and Mayalaro started using a different alternative title for each season in 2011. Topic. Cast In season 6 the main cast consisted of Dana Snyder who provided the voice of Master Shake, Carrie Means who provided the voice of Frylock, and series co-creator Dave Willis who provided the voice of both Meatwad and Carl Brutananadilevsky, and recurring character Igninocht. Season 6 also featured appearances from recurring voice cast members such as C. Martin Croker who voiced Dr. Weird in Last Last One Forever and Ever. Matt Maialaro who voiced Air, George Lowe who voiced himself as various characters, and Tommy Blatcha voiced Dr. Wongberger. Season 6 features guest many appearances. In She Creature, Dana Swanson voices She Creature, Vincent Pastor voiced Terry, Steve Sharippa voiced Terry's assistant, John Schnepp voiced Gary the Dairy Fairy in Creature from Plague Lagoon, Scott Adsit voiced Drubeka and Scott Fry as the pawn store clerk in Two and a half Star Wars out of five. Bill Hader voiced a balloon version of Adolf Hitler in Der Inflatable Führer. In Last Last One Forever and Ever. H. John Benjamin played a live action version of Master Shake named Don Shake. T. Payne played a live action version of Frylock. David Long Jr. played a live action version of Carl Brutananadilevsky. And Drake E. Stevens played an unnamed child. Long was selected after a casting call that started at the 2008 San Diego Comic Con International. Topic: Episodes. Topic: Reception. Jonah Krakow of IGN gave the Creature from Plaque Lagoon, a 7 out of 10, which is considered good, calling the episode straightforward, and comparing it to the season 4 episode, Dixode. Krakow gave Time Machine a negative score of 6.7, as well as a negative review, saying Master Shake's safety fart 
Song was the only amusing part of the episode. Two and a half Star Wars out of five, aka Pink Man, was given a 7.5 by Krakow, found several jokes throughout the episode amusing, but found the scene with Carl throwing batteries at Drew funny. He also stated, ATHF is all about the journey, not the destination. Krakow found Frylock's actions in Fry Legs a little strange and out of character for Frylock, who usually seen as the voice of reason. Krakow also found parts of Fry Legs humorous saying, Yet another enjoyable episode that delivered its share of laughs, awkwardness, and bloody chunks of flesh, and giving the episode a 7.9. Krakow found Der Inflatable Führer easy to follow and was surprised with the direction the episode went in saying, The jokes were funny, the ideas were fresh and the outcome was predictable, but fulfilling nonetheless, and giving it an 8.2. Krakow gave Last Last One Forever and Ever live action a score of 6.0, and a negative review, calling it over hyped and saying, the show lost focus and failed to deliver the one thing that has kept it going for six seasons, jokes. <laughs> Home release The first four episodes from season six were released on the Aqua Teen Hunger Force Vol. 6 DVD on December 16, 2008, months prior to their official television debuts, along with nine episodes from season five. The remaining six episodes were released on the Aqua Teen Hunger Force Vol. 7 June 1, 2010, along with five episodes from season seven. Both sets were distributed by Adult Swim and Warner Home Video and feature various special features, including behind the scenes on Last Last One Forever and Ever on the Volume 7 set. The Volume 7 DVD marks the first time episodes were released on DVD with completely uncensored dialogue. Both sets were later released in Region 4 by Madman Entertainment on February 10, 2010 and June 16, 2010 respectively. This season was also released under the label, Season 7, in HD and SD on iTunes, the Xbox Live Marketplace, and Amazon Video under the label, Volume 7. Topic. See also. Last Last One Forever and Ever List of Aqua Teen Hunger Force episodes Aqua Teen Hunger Force <laughs>